kind of musical mayhem. Acts from all corners of the globe are set to rock King's Beach, including one of South America's biggest names. As far as settings go, it doesn't get much more picturesque for a music fest. And just as importantly, the weather is set to come to the party as well. Beautiful blue skies by the beautiful beach here at Kings Beach. Um, fantastic music coming here from bands from all around the world who are coming right into our backyard. Among them, the biggest name in South America's music scene right now. For me, that I make reggae, and this is, you know, kind of an uh, ideal, you know, platform to make the music I do because it's precisely got the vibe of the beach. And to keep that vibe as clean as possible, this year's Caloundra Music Festival will also be the first in Australia to ban plastic bottles. The festival here is in such a beautiful location, uh, parklands, close to tourist amenities, so the last thing we want to do is mess it up. But if reggae or rock isn't your thing, at the piano bar there's the possibility of a more refined style of music. Hey, what do you think of the Tchaikovsky? Uh, a bit of Beethoven. Yeah, definitely, Beethoven. Definitely. You got it. You got it there. You got it. Oh, working at it. And as the setup rolls on, local businesses are looking forward to the customers rolling in. We've been blessed, uh, especially this time of the weather. Uh, last year was actually a sensation. This year I think it's going to be even bigger and better. Uh, going for a fourth day this year, first time on, on Monday, the Labor Day public holiday. One more day for a whole lot more of this. The festival kicks off tonight. Lincoln Humphreys, News. Well, right now for a preview of the weather with Hannah.